hold this camera. It's fine. Okay, so welcome back to yet another Romsky video. I know it's been a while. By a while, it's been like two weeks, so it's fine. Like, it, we're totally okay. Um, I just finished my very first competition of the season. Hopefully not the last competition of the season. It's been a weird time. So I usually go full radio silence because like I, I, w I still just want to stay focused, you know, stay in the zone. And it's been a stressful two weeks. It's always like that before competition. It's a little bit neurotic. If that's even the right word to use. I'm not sure. I need to look up the definition. I don't know. But... As you can see, I'm starting to break out a little bit. Basically, this competition is called Skate Canada Challenge. It is a uh, qualifier for nationals. And usually I don't do this event. And it's been the first time in six years that I have. Only thing is, is it's a virtual competition. So the way it works is we're all separated in regions and we're sort of doing filming. So there's a professional crew that comes in and they film programs and they're filming programs all across Canada, collecting a whole bunch of files. The only thing is we're all skating on different days. So that's a little weird. So some people might be competing like next week. <laughs> so this competition is kind of in the span of a couple weeks. And yeah, they're gonna judge it and they're, no, they're gonna stream it live in January. So a month from now, and then they're gonna judge it live. So the whole idea is they don't want any like pre-judging. The judges won't know what we did beforehand. So it's kind of more objective if that makes sense. And so we all signed non-disclosure agreements. So I can't say anything. Or else we got kicked off the national team and charged ten thousand dollars. It's a complete lie. I, I have no idea. But I, I actually don't know how much I'm supposed to be saying. I love sharing with you guys as much as I can, but I'm gonna stay on the safer side of things and not say anything before I'm like in hot water or anything. So I'm just gonna lay back. So because it's a York region, they were gonna do this competition somewhere in um, uh, Newmarket, but that fell through or something. And we did the competition in my home rink. So that was weird. I don't, I've never competed in my home rink before. <laughs> and so it's a virtual competition at my home rink on a Monday, Tuesday in the afternoon. Basically completely different than what we ever, ever do. And it's been like 10 months. And because of all that together, it was such a weird, weird mind game. But it was really nice to finally skate, you know, finally like perform and have that feeling again. Oh, it's a weird feeling. If you guys want to see it, stream it in January. What can I tell you? Uh, other than that, this was just a quick update. I haven't connected with you guys in a while, so this is my quick reconnection with you. Okay, I think I'm going to let you guys go. Uh, like this video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. And uh, I'll, catch you. I'll catch you guys soon in the next video whenever that uh, video comes out. Right now, I am just going to go home and just eat Timbits because that's that's what I'm feeling right now and taking a couple days off. Anyway, this is this is the skating life. Catch you guys in the next video. Damn it.